Get ready, get ready. Oh, what is it? Go! He's jumping, he's jumping! Keep going, keep going. You got it, you got it, keep reeling. I need to go ahead. Boys, I'm backing up, y'all can't stop reeling. Here you go, jump, 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 jump! Reel, 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 big, 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 I need to go ahead. Boys, I'm backing up, y'all. Woo! Rolling on, baby! Let's go! I knew it! <laughs> Woo! Eating line. Woo! Yeah, baby! Let's go! Holy crap! Alright, we're good, we're good. Woo! He's eating line. I know, I know. Yeah, yeah there's the end of the line. Was, oh, he freaking wrapped it. Yeah, man, he wrapped boy. it. And that goes to show you that chafe gear is so important because, yeah. I mean, it already kind of eaten a little bit of it, and then, man, that's a wrap. You know. Just the fact that we hooked that fish, man. Huh? Just the fact we hooked that fish. We, we know that giant marlin, 400, 500 pounder. Man, that's what it's all about. There. My heart's pumping. Ten. All right, so now it's nine Who's for ten, bleeding? I guess. Oh yeah, we're good. You all right? so we're gonna butterfly this. Uh, we're gonna butterfly this black fin tuna for uh, uh, a Warsaw drop bait makes them limber and a little loose they like the scent once you cut that meat open they love the scent of it and they'll find it a lot faster the last thing that i i believe is that when you cut uh which we'll do here in a second we butterfly this this uh fish out but we're not going to cut fillet all the way out we're going to leave his tail intact and all we're going to end up doing is taking out the backbone and so when you do that i think there's less uh exposed meat for like snapper and stuff like that to eat so it gives that warsaw a little bit of time to come and heat it and that's what we've, the end result we take that out nice it's good and loose and limber probably has a little bit of movement down there on the bottom which they're gonna love i'm just gonna hook them right right in the chin and up through the nose Looking for a big nasty Warsaw. We're dropping this bait all the way down to the bottom, fishing some cutoff rigs. It's a game of just getting this fish up as fast as we can once he's on. I'm excited. I thought it was a flying fish. <laughs> Woo! There he goes. Burn. He's big, he's big. He's big, big fish on. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah, baby. Eat. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Come to daddy. Come to daddy. Yeah, baby. Let's go. Let's go. I'm really, baby. I'm really. That's how you go. 
as I go. Right there, right there, right there. Yes! Let's go! Let's go, baby! That's what I'm talking about! Yeah! Woo! That's what we came here for, monster grouper. Oh, man. Ooh, that's a stun. All right, boys. Well, <sighs> this is what I call a sea monster right here. <laughs> what that is. Yeah, hold on. Let, let's go up to the front. Let's go up to the Let's go, baby! That's what I'm talking about. That's what we came here for. Woo! Look at that fish. Right before that sun goes down, this is when the absolute giant fish come out to play. We're crossing our fingers. We'll see what happens. Giant fish on! Giant fish on! Hit the tin! Oh my, big, big fish. I've been trying to pick the perfect lure. You know what I'm saying? What I like to do is that uh, you just got to get a good snip on it. A little. A little taste test right there. <laughs> <He's like under>. Got a nice fish on. What we're hoping for is a blackfin tuna. He's doing some death circles. Hopefully we got a tuna on the line. First blackfin on the boat. Got smoked by a big barracuda down there. We know there's a lot of barracuda around. Game of getting these things in as fast as we can. But uh, this guy will definitely come in handy on some yellowfin later. Blackfin, blackfin. <laughs> Beautiful fish. Way to go, Kyle. Yeah. Cameraman hooked up on a monster tuna, boy. Woo! Don't reel, don't reel when it runs. When it runs, don't reel. There you go, there you go, there you go. He will. <laughs> Jeff, how was your nap? Look at, look at, look! He's putting the flip flops off. He's serious now. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh! I was coming off of the shoes. He's all in. Yeah, look at my shirt, Ned. No sir, no sir, no sir.
not exactly what we were what we were wanting out here, especially when we're fishing from the jig, but. I think we got the first yellow fin on. Hopefully so. Smoked our trunk line. Oh yeah, nice head shakes. Start seeing him doing is doing pinwheels around the boat. That's gonna guarantee that this is a yellow fin and not a shark. Look at this. Woo! Woo! That reel's hot! Oh! What the? Dude, he hit the, there's a knot. Where was the knot? Dude, there's a knot in the reel. That hurt us big time. That hurt us big time. Last night we've had some tough luck. We put about 10, 15 uh, blackfin tuna in the boat, so we definitely got some good eating fish. The yellowfin tuna were not cooperating last night, so we're trying to pull out all the stops. Jeff uh, brought us over here to this nice little spot, we'll finish it off with some kingfish. So we've got a bunch of different varieties of fish in the boat. On to the last stop, and we're going home. Start filleting some fish. It's real simple. Just straight wire, one span of sardine through the eyeballs. Get out there, chunk it out there, just let it float. Look at it. I see it, I see it. Whoa, just like that. You can see him fighting over it right underneath there. He's still getting it, he still wants it. Oh. Booyah! Golly. Got him! <laughs> you see him? I got it. It's like unreal, Sharky. They're literally like you throw that bait in there and they're fighting over it. There you go. You really got it. Thank you, bro. Thank you, bro. But, uh, you want to look at, look, did you shave? Come here, Poppy. Game time, baby. Hell let's yeah. go slay some fish. Let's go, let's, let's go. go. We out. We're coming. Hey, what's up? <laughs> I don't know what I should say or what I shouldn't say. We're going? We're going, baby. We're going, We're man. Going. We are going. August, wait, July 27th? August, August 27th. Yeah, he, knows. Had it marked he, off. he knows. He knows. He said he canceled a wedding. <laughs> he did. I was going to tell you. He canceled a wedding. Can spoil it now? Should we spoil it? No, no we shouldn't spoil it. No. But look at this bad A right here, dude. I cannot wait. Isn't that thing sick?